In 1970, interiors were refined, including redesigned seats for additional headroom and easier access to rear storage. The car was updated with fender flares, and I do want to point these out because it is a very subtle difference. In 1970, 69, you'll see the flare about the same, and it ends, if I can look at my 69s, right here, and then in 1970, they brought this out. The reason was to get the debris, to catch the debris coming from the tire, not only in the front, but in the rear of the car as well. On a 69, it ends about right there, and this is flared out to catch the debris coming off the tire. Trivia to wonder your friends with. 1970 blue four speed, 350, 350. Now, 1970, if you all have ever come to see me or talk to me, you all know that there was a labor issue in 1970, so our production of that model was a little less. To be exact, 17,316, 6,648 convertibles, and only 4,910 total 350 horses ever made. This is a power brake car with power steering, an M21 four speed, and a matching numbers car, which makes this a pretty rare 1970. A really fun driving car. I've had the pleasure, and at a later date, we will do more video of the drive of the car. Interior is in excellent shape. Our carpeting and seats, uh, there's no rips, tears, or issues. Our center console, all nice and clean. Um, our, all of our gauges working, of course, as you guys have heard from me say before, except for the clock. White top on the car is in excellent shape. I do want to point out, I do have some blemishes on the seat, and I can show you exactly how that happens when the seat's down and that it will catch. Um, the w white top is in like new condition with a nice clear window in the back and a nice car cover to boot. Sixty-nine and seventy before the government got involved in emissions and got involved in crash tests. So you get both bumpers, full horsepower, and actually a whole bunch of fun to drive. Blue is probably one of the most popular colors of this car, and this one is in excellent shape. If you're looking for a bumper year, and these are going up, folks, they ain't going to be this price for long. Give me a call: seven seven zero six zero five. 2056 or email john at buyavet.net. Subscribe to the YouTube channel so you get to see all the new stuff first. We'll see you out on the road.